Uh, hi, today I have a combination padlock in the package. It's a hard hat, uh, four wheel, hard hat, four wheel combination padlock. On this side, it's saying six millimeter shackle. Uh, yeah, it's saying how we can open it, change the code, and where's the English? English currently is zero, zero, zero. Open the lock. And turn it uh, the shackle uh, 19 degrees. Keep the shackle pressed down. And enter the designed combination. Release the shackle. Return the shackle to the original position. Etc. Etc. It's Eula. Uh, it's made in China. Item number three four two five five one. So yeah, let's open this one and let's try to pick it. Uh, uh, sorry, to decode it, and we can check. If we can decode it and or we can if we can shim it and if there are false gates or not so let's see blue one let me put zero zero oops here is zero 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 field Chinese so yeah let me turn 90 degrees like this oh there is no spring so let me Change the combination. Let me try to put it, everything in a gate. There, there. Yes. And I don't know now the combination. So let's do one thing. I think, can I put my 0.4? Can I move it here and try to check if there are false gates here? Uh, not false gates. No, it's thinner than I expected, but yeah, let's do it the old fashioned way. Let's decode it. So, my usual padlock. Let's pull the shackle like this. The lighting, the lighting is not that good, but let's put it zero zero zero, and I will start. I will do the jiggling test. So this is now. Oh, look at this! This is probably true gate. This is this is not binding, or maybe it's binding. Maybe that's how the gates work. So let me. Oh, this is like, this is very easy, if it's like this, really, it's probably not that easy, so this is moving a lot, this is not, this is moving a lot, this is moving a lot, so this is like, there are a lot of play, so I need to figure it out. This is a lot of play, this is not a lot of play, this is a lot of play. I think this is not, there are false gates definitely. This is small play, this is a lot of play, a lot of play, and small play. Yes. I need to put it in the gate, they are like trying to escape, sorry, trying to not to they're like, I, I, I don't know what to say, this is very strange, I never felt this kind of thing, this is, this is not probably the right gate, this is the gate, this is not in the right gate, and like, every next gate is like, after four or five numbers, it's not like, Unbelievable, but it's still I cannot decode it, so it's it's not that probably easy. Unbelievable. The place, so I cannot even determine. It. So let me do this kind of difficulty. Yes, so maybe this will help me. No.
think this is not the right one. And others are moving. Probably this is the right one, right one, right one, wrong one. But I don't know what's the right number, like they are moving. No. <laughs> no. I don't know what to say. It's like the numbers are moving a lot. But this is not opening. And even when I try to move the shackle, it's moving the shackle, and even when I move it left and right, like nothing is happening. Like the shackle is moving a bit by bit, but I still cannot determine the last wheel. Seven, nothing. Six, nothing. Five, nothing. Four. Or is a one gate it's a gate to it's a gate so probably every second number no oh this is becoming like a so eight I think it eight is I cannot determine the. I was thinking it's going to be easy, but it's not easy at all. Six, no. Four, no. Two, no. Zero, no. Eight. I think the last one is eight. So this one, nine is no, seven, yes it's seven and I needed to juggle it left and right to open it, unbelievable, <laughs> my hand hurts and this was a interesting pick, let's say it like that, let me grab a shim, I just wanted to check if this can be like uh, easily decoded by the shims with shim. Uh, so it was five 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 seven eight. Unbelievable! I needed a lot of time too. But let me check. Here's a small shim. Let me check on the left side if we can feel some changes in the. Yes. Yes. Or maybe not that. Yes. Zero. Five. It's very strange on the other side. Again, okay, zero. And five. Let me check, it's like opposite. Can zero and five. Let me check this one. It's a one or two and seven. It's deeper in the seventh. This is eight, so probably on the other side will be two, yes. So, so in this case we need to check if this is a, what was the number, 5, 5, 7, 8, so if we change this one for something else, put everything in a gate, remove it, let me check 0, 
we need to check uh, two numbers, four wheels. Uh, that's probably how my math is late night. Let me check. We need to check 16 combinations, I think. Five. Five and zero. Four. And nine. Four and nine, probably. Same. Come on, don't tell me five and zero. Five. So, let's check. Five, nine, five. No. Five, zero. No. So, let's put here five and change this to four. No, then zero four. No. So let's go back zero four. Zero four. Yeah. So let's say did I miss the combination? Hopefully not. It's not that. So we are checking this nine. Yes. It's zero nine four five. <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh guys, it was very interesting decoding process. So yeah, I will try not to shorten this video, but not make it long. But this was a very interesting out of the box decoding hard hat, very genesium, easily can be easily done. Um, you need to feel the, you need to know the feeling of the of the false and true gates, and somehow there are two of them. And in this case, uh, the second method is to just go through the with some shim and try to figure out the gate. So yeah, that was the hard hat uh, 40 millimeters uh, uh, combination, four wheel combination padlock uh, decoded two ways. So guys, thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Have a nice speaking. And bye bye.